Hey everyone, it's Ken here from Northern Viking Everyday. Today we're gonna to be showing you how to set up your GoPro Hero 12 Black as a webcam with your computer. It's really quite simple to set up and you'll be able to use your GoPro for meetings or just chatting with your friends. So let's go ahead, dive right into it. So before we get started, your GoPro does need to be on the latest firmware to be able to use it as a webcam. So if you don't know how to do that, I have created a couple videos, how to do it with the app as well as how to do it manually. I'll have those linked below in the description. The other thing we're gonna need is a USB-C cable, whether it's a USB-A to USB-C, like what came with your GoPro, these are pretty short. So I use a longer USB-C to USB-C cable if that's available for your computer, if you have USB-C, that might be a good option, or you can get these in USB-A to USB-C. And I'll have those longer cables linked down below in the description if you do wanna pick one up for yourself. But let's jump into setting this up. So I'm using a Windows PC here, but if you're using a Mac, they do have software available for you as well. The process will be slightly different for setting it up, but you should be able to figure it out with what we're doing here today. So here on gopro.com, up at the top, you're gonna see a few different options. There's an option here that says apps. If you hover over that, it'll give you some software that you can download. And one of the options is the GoPro webcam. You can go ahead and left click on that. And that'll take you to where you can download the software and again this is available for Mac here as well as Windows so go ahead and select download and get started if you're using a Mac or download and get started if you're using a PC I'm gonna go ahead and select the PC option and it'll give you some instructions here and again it's saying your GoPro does need to be updated for this to work now I do want to mention if I scroll down a little bit here it does give us a list of apps that this works well with and um, or popular tools that are supported. So Zoom, WebEx, Slack, Google Meet, Microsoft Teams, Skype, GoToMeeting, Facebook Rooms, and Discord, plus more are available. So um, if you're using any of those, you should be able to use your GoPro as a webcam. So if we go back up here, getting started with GoPro webcam for Windows, there's the option here that says download the GoPro webcam desktop utility, click here. So we'll click here and it's gonna take us to another page and at the top here, you'll see an option that says download. So let's go ahead and click on that. And the software should start downloading to our downloads folder. You can see it's downloading here and it's just about done. So um, you can go ahead and click on that and start opening it up. If you don't have the pop-up here, we'll head on down to our start menu, right click on it and go to our file explorer. We can find our downloads here on the left-hand side and it should be right in there. So let's go ahead and open up that downloaded file. Welcome to the GoPro webcam setup wizard. And we're gonna go ahead and hit next here. You can read the end user license agreement here. And once you've done that, you can accept it and then hit next. And then it says ready to install GoPro webcam. Click install to begin the installation. We'll hit install here. You might get a pop-up. It'll install that. Completed the GoPro webcam setup wizard. Click the finish button to exit the setup wizard. So let's go ahead and hit finish. You must restart your system for the configuration changes made to GoPro webcam to take effect. So I'm gonna go ahead and restart my system here and then I'll come back to you once I've done that. So the software is installed on my computer, but the next thing we need to do is plug in our USB-C cable into our GoPro. So on the side here, there is a little door. We can pull that little lever down, open the door like that, and we'll plug in our USB-C cable that goes to our computer on the side, just like that. And then I'll go ahead and turn on my GoPro. So back here on my desktop with the software installed, if I look at my GoPro now, it now says USB connected on the screen. So I know it is connected to my computer properly. Now let's go ahead and open up the software. In the bottom right hand corner, we're looking for a new little icon that looks like a GoPro. And if you're not seeing it out here, you should have a little arrow here that says show hidden icons. And in here with your apps, I do have a new icon here. It's a GoPro, small little GoPro with a blue dot. It says GoPro webcam. We can go ahead and left click on that. And it should give us the option here to preview. And that's what we're looking for today. So let's go ahead and hit preview. And there I am. We can preview ourselves. It's working perfectly. I believe this is currently the linear lens that's on there. So um, there are a few different lenses that you can choose. I like the linear one that doesn't give you the fisheye effect but we can change those easily. So back here to the icon. Actually, now that it's running, it says active on my screen on the GoPro and there's a red circle 
here by the logo here in the system tray. So um, if you're wondering if it is running, it will say active on the screen. Now let's go ahead and left click on that again and you can select different lens here under lens mode. So we can go all the way up to super view, which is gonna give us a huge view here. You can see how wide that is. Or you can go back here. There's a few different options. There's wide, there's linear, and there's narrow. Narrow will bring it right in if you want a smaller view, um, just like that. More of a typical webcam view. So you do have a few different options there. I happen to like the linear view, so I'm gonna put it back on the linear view. Just like that. Now, what we're gonna do, I'm gonna close out this preview and make it smaller and I'm gonna go open up a Google Meet here and I'll show you what you have to do in Google Meet to get this to work. And it's gonna be different if you're using Zoom or Discord, different programs, you are gonna to need to select your webcam. So if we open up a Google Meet here, I can go down to my options here at the bottom under settings and we do need to click on video here. And again, this will be slightly different on each program, but make sure you do select your GoPro webcam like that for it to start working. And now I should show up in my Google Meet using a webcam here. So it did mirror it in Google Meet, but it does give you that option as well. So make sure you set that up properly in whatever software you're using. And really it's that simple to set up your GoPro Hero 12 Black as a webcam with your PC.